barely know what to say. You barely know what to say? Barely. What do you even mean? <laughs> I feel like you were like born to be on camera. Oh my gosh. Well, she's opening this. It's her essential oil box. My mom, she loves essential oil. So just don't blame me. I love them. <laughs> Hello. Welcome to my channel. Cadence is here with me. And it's been a while since mom has done these. It's been a while since I've done these. And it's been a while since Cadence has joined me in one of these videos. So, these videos. So, these videos. So, this is a treat, and I'm excited to be here. Cadence is excited to be here. I'm excited to open these. So excited. She loves essential oils, so she has like a whole bin in there, right in a cubby, and it's like a lot of essential oils, so she like has like a thousand, maybe 24 maybe. <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't know it's between much. 24 and 1,000, that's for sure. Um, I'm not sure how many I have. And but she's going to get more today because she got an essential oils box. Yes, I did. <laughs> and this is a bonus essential oils box because yeah. I used my essential rewards points. This is not my monthly essential rewards order. This is me using the essential rewards points and getting free stuff. <laughs> that is what this is. Yeah. I have saved up my points for months and months and they've just racked up. Uh, it doesn't yeah. take that long actually um, to have them add up monthly. I had 370 points or something like that that I could use and then I had some credits as well. I used all of those and I got like $430 worth of free oils and free product because I think one thing in here is not oils mm -hmm. but for the most part it's oils and regardless it's free product I spent $15 that is all I spent it's time to open the package let's open it let's open it I'm excited are you excited yeah oh my goodness I'm gonna lift up the little essential oils and I'm gonna say I go off something okay with the essential oils okay so I'm basically the helper kind of. You're basically the helper kind of. All right, so I'm gonna start with the thing that is not an oil. No. And it is the Satin Facial Scrub. It's mint. It's a mint satin facial scrub. Um, and I'm all about face stuff. Anything to like exfoliate skin or wash it. I'm all about face masks. Mm -hmm. I'm not the best at it but like I love doing it it feels so good it's like relaxing and pamper time for myself my skin is not really irritable so there's a lot of products that I can use and it doesn't really bother me or affect anything on my face other than I have a massive pimple on my nose right now and it's it's huge <laughs> Yesterday, it was so red and so swollen because it was like under the skin. I looked like Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. <laughs> and I was like, well, this is timely because <laughs> tis the season. It's better now. I have like so many different scrubs and masks and all that that I use from time to time. So adding stuff to my collection is always fun. Okay, so that's the first product. Oh yeah, and you want to say something really quick about it? It's really quick. Um, really minty and really special for your face. Boom. All right, I got more cinnamon lip balm. Um, in the fall and winter season, I switch over to cinnamon, and it is cinnamony and minty and cinnamonty and amazing. Um, really minty and really cinnamony and really good for your lips. Now we're going to move on to essential oils, of course. All right. So now we've got oils, and this is the exciting part. So this is Release 
This is an emotional oil for processing things, going through some things. This is the 15 milliliter bottle. It helps when you're having a really bad day or if you're going through something really tough or there's stuff that's lingering emotionally. It really releases your, um, your actions and if you're like mad at me, if mom's mad at me, you can just um, get release, get your diffuser, fill um, your diffuser up with water and put some release in it and it will relax your day. It will relax your day. Amen. 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 Geranium. Uh, to be honest, I don't really know. <laughs> I don't really know what geranium does. I got it because there's certain blends that I want to make and I definitely need geranium for them. So honestly, I got it kind of specifically to make blends. I will keep you posted on everything that is geranium. So uh, you can mix it up with the other little essential oils and mom has thieves maybe you can probably mix it up with a little thieves and then egg and geranium and thieves can make like a really good set of oils so very good yes i love it let's do this let's do this eucalyptus radiata this is just essentially uh, essentially eucalyptus. There are three kinds of eucalyptus. I got one that is going to be beneficial for us um, when we have sniffles or in the season where we're sneezing and coughing and all of that. This is going to be really good to diffuse. They all kind of do the same thing, the three different kinds of eucalyptus, but some of them have different um, strengths. This one um, it's kind of like germanium. It can kind of like um, relax your day. It's a menthol-y one, kind of like peppermint. So it helps you to be able to breathe. So it can help you breathe in and out. And it's like really neat to use. But three different kinds and really good. So. Very good. I'm unrolling. What's that? Frankincense. Oh, I smell it. I love frankincense, you guys. I have been out of frankincense for a few months and yeah. I have not been happy about it. I think it's an extremely important oil for so many different reasons. You literally can use frankincense for miraculous things, seriously. It's a grounding oil, so it really helps you to feel grounded if you want more of that again that emotional clearly we're an emotional family <laughs> where we've got to release a lot and we've got to be grounded okay so frankincense mom loves frankincense she's a fan of frankincense i'm a fan of frankincense and it smells really good it smells like frankincense and it is frankincense genius so Genius. That was genius. And frankincense is honestly one of my top favorite oils. Top. Top favorite. It's good from for everything. I'm like genuinely, this is a this is a miracle oil. I'm not joking. No. Do your research. Look up frankincense. Research. I got sage. To be honest, I don't really know a ton about sage, so I'm gonna do more research. However, sage is another one of those, just like geranium, where it's really good in a couple roller blends that I wanted to make and so I want to have sage on hand. I don't feel like I will use sage very often, but when I need it, I want to have it. Sage is a really, really good oil. You can help it for cooking. It, you can put it in a diffuser and blend it in with um, other essential oils. Yep. And sage is really good. That's good. Thank you. And we will learn more about sage. The next one is M grain. You guys, I have wanted to get M grain for probably since shortly after I got my starter kit, which was three years, almost three years ago. There's really good blends out there for head tension, 
with like peppermint and pan away, but that doesn't work for my head. When I'm not feeling well and my head is just like killing me, when I put peppermint and pan away on my head, for me, it doesn't work. The peppermint and the pan away just makes my head worse. Um, and it's supposed to do the opposite. And for a lot of people, it does do the opposite. But for me, it doesn't really work. I've heard about emigraine. I've heard all kinds of things about it. It's good for things that are worse than just regular head tension. I don't get really, really heavy head tension very often, but when I do, I really want something natural that I could use instead of taking medicine. I prefer to not take medicine if I don't have to. I'm not against it. It's just if I can go the natural route first, that's what I want to do. I'll keep you guys posted on what it does for me. Also, let me see. I wanted to see what was in it. So basil, marjoram, lavender, Roman chamomile, peppermint, helichrysum. That's it. So there's peppermint in it, but it's definitely the second to the last oil that's in it, which means there are other more prominent oils in this blend. Oh my gosh, so many oils. I got so many oils. This is Christmas. Guys, this is Christmas for me. Seriously. So this one, oh my gosh, this one I'm so excited about. This one is called Helichrysum. And I don't know if you heard me saying Helichrysum when I was naming off the oils in here, but it's in here. But I got a whole nother bottle of Helichrysum because I have been wanting this oil for so long. It's been this like, oh my gosh, amazing oil that can like really take care of owies, serious owies, serious owies. Look it up. This oil is it's like frankincense where it's like a miracle worker. I feel like helichrysum is like powerful, powerful stuff. It is a small five milliliter bottle and it is expensive. <laughs> it is not cheap, but the stuff that I've seen it do makes it so worth it. And I don't really have a ton that I need it for, but I want it in my collection. I got it with my free points because I felt like that was a good time to get it. I don't need it for anything specific just yet. That's the beauty about the points is that you have them so that you can get other oils that you probably wouldn't normally purchase or that are a little too expensive. So you can't just regularly throw it in your shopping cart kind of a thing. I took the opportunity. Okay, the next one is myrrh. And it's funny that I got frankincense and myrrh <laughs> in the same order. I thought that was really funny. So myrrh is an oil also that I have been dying to get um, since I've started. It's like, gosh, it'd be so fun to have myrrh as an essential oil in my home. Like how cool is it that I now own myrrh? Frankincense and myrrh, um, it's also, they're very similar. So this is also a grounding oil. Um, I don't really know a ton about myrrh, um, but I do know that it has some strong grounding properties as well. Um, and I'm really, really excited to get to know this oil a little bit more. And it's an extra oil, I don't need it but I wanted it. And that's what this order is. Most of it, frankincense I needed. The rest of it, the rest of it I wanted. Oh, this is not a part of the, the order. Um, I'm just gonna scoop those over there. All right, I think I have one oil left and this is actually making me kind of sad. Cinnamon bark. We use a lot of cinnamon bark this season um, for Christmas, stuff. I'm diffusing Christmas spirit. I'm diffusing cinnamon, nutmeg, and clove, and you know, you can put them all together and make really heavy blends. So, all right, that's it. Life is good, things are so good. I wanted to share this haul with you guys, and I wanna do more of these. So, um, I'm gonna keep you guys posted. I would say follow me on Instagram. I'm gonna post both of my Instagram handles below. Stay tuned, seriously, stay tuned, I promise. I'm gonna get my life together at some point. This is fun for me though. I never want to stop. I'm really thankful that you guys are here. Thank you for subscribing. I've gained a couple subscribers in the last couple weeks and I'm just so thankful. I recognize it. I see you and I appreciate you. 
stick around, click that notification bell if you haven't already, subscribe if you haven't already. If I'm posting videos, it will be on Friday. So click the bell because that's gonna help you to know when I do post a video. Thank you for watching. I will see you guys next time. Bye.